Suspense is building at the border over the future of restrictions placed on asylum seekers. The Supreme Court issued a temporary order to keep pandemic era limits on migrants, but there's still a good chance the policy could be lifted very soon. This morning, a bus carrying migrants from a detention facility arrived in Dallas at Oaklawn United Methodist Church. The charitable organization Faith Forward Dallas will help them move from Dallas to final destinations elsewhere in the U.S. Dallas County Judge Clay Jenkins says the migrants will stay no more than 36 hours here. Another bus is set to arrive in Dallas tomorrow. The church serves as a welcoming and hospitality center where volunteers help cover basic needs. Food, uh, codes, I mean, real something so they can stay warm. We're going to uh, help the families to process their travel uh, so that we can provide transportation as well. So they're going to go to their sponsors uh, and to see their families before Christmas. So that's our hope. There are also personal connections that motivate some of the church staff to lend a hand to the migrants. It touched my heart because I was in a detention center 30 years ago. So I'm doing this because I know what it feels to be in a detention center. I was uh, five months there. So we serve as a church as part of our ministry, knowing that uh, these people deserve to new opportunities. These people are looking for better ways of living. So, and we want to be on that part of their journey so they can know that this country is a welcoming country and is full of diversity and is full of people from different origins. So we are here for them. In response to the high court decision maintaining Title 42, at least temporarily, Governor Greg Abbott tweeted, Texas and other states are insisting the court leave Title 42 in place. He says it helps prevent illegal immigration. The restrictions were set to expire tomorrow.